Hi, my name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. In my household, there's me, my husband, and our adorable three-year-old little boy. On our channel, you'll find simple and tasty recipes using everyday ingredients. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, we are having this thin crust pizza from HEB. It's Italian sausage and pepperoni. And I made it on this pizza rack, this little silver pizza rack that I got from Walmart a while back ago. Um, if you wanna make pizzas on your oven rack, but you're worried about stuff falling through like the oven rack, um, you just use this. So I've got it resting on a cutting board, um, but quick and easy dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, we are having this chicken lo mein. It's from Aldi, it was in my freezer. I got it on an Aldi haul, and it was quick and easy to throw together. Um, as always, whenever I make these little quick meals, I always add extra vegetables, so I added in some extra broccoli. I didn't have to add any extra salt, any extra sauce, or anything like that, just the broccoli. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, we are having pinto beans and rice. I do have a video on our channel showing how I make um, my pinto beans with smoked ham hocks. Now tonight, I did, or today I should say, I did not make them with ham hocks, trying to be a little bit healthier. Um, but like I said, I will link that recipe in the description box. It is very, very easy to follow. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, Howard grilled some chicken wings. I forgot to save the package, but in my freezer, I had a package of, I think these are bourbon black pepper chicken wings that I picked up from Tom Thumb's meat section, and they smell absolutely delicious, serving it with some fresh corn on the cob with butter, and um, these cheesy cheddar noodles from Noor. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time. Hey guys, so we are having breakfast for dinner tonight, and I am making biscuits and gravy and quick fried potatoes. So in my pot here, I have about three large potatoes that I have sliced and peeled, waiting on those to boil. I'm not gonna cook them all the way. I just want them to be a little bit tender. And in this skillet, I've got some olive oil and then um, to save time, I'm using frozen fajita uh, blend. So I've got, well in this bag is red and green um, peppers and then also some onions. So I'm just waiting for these vegetables to get done. I'm gonna drain these potatoes and add them to the skillet and just fry them up. So I just added my potatoes to the skillet and then I am using this mixed up salt. I really like this a lot. It has salt and different herbs in there. It has a really good flavor. But I'm just going to cover the skillet and let these soften and brown until um, they look like I want them to look. <laughs> okay, so here is our dinner all plated up, sprinkled a little parsley right on top. And as you can see, there are the potatoes, quick and easy to make. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we will see y'all next time.